Hello, Tessa T families. I'm Meg Killingsworth, and welcome to the Facebook Friday Show. We are here with two great guests talking about Fine Arts Night that is coming up next Tuesday. Hello, ladies. Hello. Welcome. Hello. And we have a bunch of Silver City families watching now, too. So let's start by introducing ourselves. I'm Julie Hubbard. I'm, I'm the art teacher here at Chester T. I'm Melanie Roper, and I teach music and chorus. And they're here to tell us all about this exciting night coming up. So, Miss Hubbard, let's start with you. That's right. We have our annual Fine Arts Night coming up next Tuesday night, March 27th, from 5 to 7. Um, each student here at Chester T will have a framed piece of art. Um, the artwork will be on display during the day uh, for the students to see and then the parents are going to be able to come to the school from 5 to 7 to view their child's artwork and at this point every child has it has the frame and the parents can purchase the frame for $25 the proceeds for this sale come back to Chester T to um, go into our art fund that's part of my budget for the following year so this is a very important fundraiser for our school um, I did say that they're $25 but the night of the show it is only cash and check we can't take any credit cards or anything like that so um, cash or check only if you noticed last week you got these blue sheets these are our pre-sale forms the pre-sale forms went home and if you ordered um, early I will pull your artwork that night if you marked on the form that you're not able to attend you'll be able to pick it up in the front office after the show on Wednesday you can go at any point during the day to pick those up um, if you marked on the form that you will be here but you wanted to to go ahead and pre-sale I'll have those pulled and you can go to the pre-sale table and just pick those up and go I know there's a lot of things going on, um, ball games and whatnot, and, and different meetings. I think at the middle school there's a meeting that night. So um, if you if you want to pre-sale, I will pull that for you and you can come and grab it and go. Um, something that we need to make sure that we do though, I've got to have the forms no later than Monday. Um, the show is on Tuesday night. It's very difficult for me if I get a form late on the day in the day on Tuesday of the show. Maybe I won't get it, and then you know I, I won't have an opportunity to pull the work. So if you want to pre-sale, make sure that you turn that in. If you don't have a form and you want to just go ahead and pre-sale, write on the envelope Art Show Hubbard your student's name and the teacher's name, and I can pull it for you then with a cash or check for twenty-five dollars. Um, there is going to be a post sale. If you miss the show, um, or unable to, to attend and you don't have a chance to do the pre-sale, you can participate in a post sale. The only drawback is the post sale is only until Friday, um, March the 30th. After that, we're completely cut off and the artwork goes back to the company the night of the show anyway, but they're able to send us post sale artworks. And the price goes up to $30. So if you don't have an opportunity to order, you still can by Friday. But the price goes up. So I want to go ahead and, and encourage you, if you're interested in buying your artwork for your child or your children, um, to go ahead and get those pre-sales in for $25 each. Or come the night of the show, view the show. It's beautiful. All the artwork, I'm so proud of our students. We've been working on these since Christmas, since before Christmas. So... Um, it's something that, that we always look forward to every year, and I'm very excited for our show this year. Great. Lots of information there. And if you do write a check, make it payable to Chester T. Yes. I wrote my check and turned it in. Um, we're so excited to hang that beautiful artwork in our home. Thank you. So, Miss Roper, tell us all about the chorus. Well, the Chester T. Chorus, which is made up of fourth and fifth graders, this year for our Fine Arts Night, we are performing Rock and Roll Forever. This is a musical that we've been working on since January. And for all those rock and roll fans, that you're going to hear songs that you recognize, speaking parts and things like that. There's a few little dance moves in there, too. Any Elvis in there? There's some Elvis in there. <laughs> we had to put that in because of Miss Hubbard. But we're working on our program really hard, and the kids are excited about performing here, as well as at the, the Synergy Festival the, this next Tuesday, and then we have this coming up, too. So we've got two big performances coming up, but the chorus is singing at 6.30 on Fine Arts Night. So you can go enjoy the art show and then come straight in here to the cafeteria where we will be performing our Rock and Roll Forever. 
Also that night, uh, in the media center, we will be having our book fair open late that night. So if your children didn't get to enjoy it during the day, uh, it will also be something you could come in that night and you know pick out some books as well for your kids at the book fair. And all of that is also uh, some of our big fundraisers for the school. So come and support our art show. Come and support our media center for our library and our uh, book fair. So find out that we got lots going on lots in the going on. going on. It'll be a busy night. Yes. Um, and that book fair being open late is great because I like to bring my credit card versus just a check to hand over to the girls. So I like to shop with them and help them pick out some books too. So it's open late for you. Miss Wiggins did that as a special treat um, so that families can come that aren't able to come during the day. Hey, and we've got bingo night tonight. Thank you to PTO for sponsoring that huge event. The doors will open for Chick-fil-A at 5.30. Bingo starts at 6.30. There are so many wonderful prizes that you can come and win either through bingo or a raffle. And so we hope to see you tonight, Friday night, uh, for bingo night, and then again on Tuesday for Fun Arts Night. Hey, have a great weekend, everybody, and we will see you real soon. Thanks for joining us today. Bye. Bye. -bye.